Hi guys, so I'm not sure if you saw this or if it was just me that saw this pretty lately, late, but I saw that there was an accident where a giant screen crashed into two dancers and it was during a concert, a mirror concert. So a quick information about Mirror. Mirror is a canto pop group based in Hong Kong. They have 12 members and they were having a concert if I, based on the time, it would have been yesterday. So, um, on the 28th. And so I'm pretty sure you've seen on Twitter how there's a screen and then it fell. And it most likely hit uh, <laughs> the mirror members because 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 or not who knows we 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 aren't really told it, it's just a guess based off of how many members were on stage but then since there's like 14 people on stage we there's not not really much uh, I know because I'm not I don't really look into mirror, but I hope that there is uh, an investigation lesson because whoever put these screens up, there is a, there should be a certain safety feature because when there's like when if you think of like an engineering sense, like whenever a crane is bringing up a heavy load, there's a certain way that if the load has to be held and how many support like strings are held at the center of the uh, lifts uh, hook and it seems that there could have been an issue with the support uh, wires that was keeping the screen up and from what I know I'm there this there's going to be a lot of <laughs> legal issues because if this, if, like, what do you expect? Of course there's going to be legal issues. Okay, so, since this is a LED screen, I don't know how big it is. Um, hairs everywhere. Uh, let's see, LED screen. Oh my gosh, gosh darn it. I don't want to subscribe, but let's see. Con, uh, oh, weight of LED screen. I guess tall. By twelve. Twelve kilograms per square meter, so hundred forty four uh if we're basing off of over here transparent lead screen it's per square feet is twelve kg. So Oh my gosh, this is not, I, I must have calculated something wrong because, please don't let it be that big, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, that is, that is, please don't let it be that big, oh my god, if it's actually that big, okay, so two of the dancers are, has been hospitalized, uh, one is in, has neck injuries and is in serious condition while another, uh, in less serious condition. It was, let's see. Um, yeah, please don't. Okay, so the what most likely the one that got hit head on was the one in intensive care, and then the other one is stable condition. That's good. Oh my gosh. The Coliseum was 23 meters high or 75 feet high, and. Oh, oh my gosh, thank God, it's 5 by 4 meters. Okay, so 5 times 4 is 20. 20 times 12 is 240. 240 kg is still 500 pounds. 500 pounds to someone's head. I don't need to search it up to be like it is that is serious it's dangerous if, if that person is going to be in serious condition like if they're in the intensive oh my gosh okay 
back to the thing okay so the person was given medical condition uh, medical treatment and was sent to uh, the hospital and if we were to look at this picture we can see that most like it seems that oh the two wires that I was holding it most likely those were the electric wires sending the uh, uh, imaging to the LED screen and this white wire here this could have been the sub like the last the elastic uh, rope that was ho supporting it or metal rope but it seems to have snapped what could have caused it to snap oh it's not clear so that's why they're going to be reviewing it it's a shame because I, I feel really sorry for the members because it's traumatizing like it, two of your uh, two dancers that you were dancing next to were hit like it could have been a member it could have been like a backup dancer who knows and the f also I feel really bad for the the audience because they were enjoying watching the group and suddenly like, this traumatic event happened oh my gosh I'm so sorry for everyone that happened let's see one member fell off the stage during the second day and he was not injured wait does that let's see but it's so there should have there seems to be issues with the uh, I guess the stadium because uh, one of the members fell off maybe it was because of lighting and at least he was not hurt because it was a meter around three feet so but three feet is still high depending on how you fall it could get you could get hurt really badly it reminds me of the of Wendy's uh, fall like she ended up hurting her face and like her shoulder and how did you go into surgery oh my god I hope that uh, whoever's injured heals quickly and heals well and there's no lasting effect like uh, on physically and I hope that everyone's mental state is okay but and I hope they are able to go to therapy to go th through this traumatic event and realize they were at the fault and this was something that the organizer concert organizers needed to look into and especially the stage people or not the stage people um who usually do, does the LED whoever does that they needed they need to be held accountable they have to get looked into like they have to be investigated like to see if like if their licenses should be revoked or they should go back to their classes and have like uh, like I guess a redo classes to make sure they pass again and keep their standards up to date because if this if this was instead of like just an LED panel it was one of those uh, I guess in basketball stadiums they have a connected four panel LED connected with a bunch of metal if it was what if it was that that fell down there's technical difficulties that happen all the time but like something like this should be taken in precaution and I hope that this doesn't happen again in the future because in K-pop, I'm pretty sure like you guys have seen instances of this happening in K-pop. Um, I guess uh, I I don't remember who, but uh, one one I think the MC he was walking on the stage and suddenly there's an open hole because it was supposed to be a K-pop member going up, but turns out that it wasn't like blocked out at that time, so he didn't know and he fell and. He fell on Jungkook. I'm I'm sure people don't remember about that or know about the incident, even though I, I don't remember who was in that incident other than Jungkook and uh, MC. Um, it was during a uh, awards show, if I remember correctly. Don't remember which one. And there's another issue, and I think it was an SM concert where, like, uh, I don't know uh, who was in it, but I think it, the backdrop was coming down it was a circle like led light that was coming down and it almost hit the members uh, of for uh, i guess uh, the 
members in SM family because they were doing an SM concert. And like issues like this sh should be rare and should not go to the extent of being this dangerous. So yeah, p if people were up to date with their knowledge on how to make uh, all the connections correctly and like stay humble and uh, be proactive in what they're doing, I hope that like it could limit uh, uh, accidents like this. I'm praying for the members, hoping that they heal, or the, the two dancers, hoping that they'll heal quickly and recover quickly. Uh, if you want to read in depth to this, I'll link the, um, the article in the URL and, uh, the article in the URL, no, sorry, I'll link the article in the description. Um, thank you for listening to my kind of worried rant. Um, hope you have a great day and I hope your day is, or day or night is filled with happiness and no accidents. Thank you so much for watching and I see you guys later. Bye!